everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are covering a MCQ from Unit 1.1 for AP Calc AB. So this question here provides us with this graph, and it states a particle is moving on the x-axis, and the position of the particle at time t is given by x of t. So this over here, our y-axis, gives the position of the particle. And then, of course, over here, our x-axis, or in this case, we're calling it our t-axis, is going to give us time. So now whose graph is given above? Which of the following is the best estimate for the speed of the particle at time t equals 8? So right here. So the key thing we need to know here is we need to understand how position and time relate to speed. So speed is basically going to be the average rate of change of the position with relation to time. So said in a different way, when we're looking at this graph, what we want to look for is we want to look for the average rate of change, which is really just a representation of the slope. So we could, of course, pick two points, like I could pick this point here and this point here, and I could use my Algebra 1 formula of, you know, just my slope formula, m equals y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 to get my rate of change there. But really, if you're comfortable with it, it's easier to just use this graph and just recognize that right here, this slope is zero, right? Any horizontal line is going to have a slope of zero. So I'm automatically just going to select answer choice A, which is zero, and then call it a day. All right, hope that was helpful. See you in the next one.